It is about that time, ladies and gentlemen. The Last of Us 2 hype train is officially getting started, where we start getting a ton of news and information from both Naughty Dog and Sony as Days Gone releases very soon, and that opens up Sony and Naughty Dog to start pushing, marketing, promoting, advertising, anything you want to call it. They can start putting The Last of Us 2 in front of the world for them to see, so people can hopefully buy the game when it does release. So we are going to jump right into the latest news and information. Something absolutely major, potentially meaning a huge reveal that is incoming within the next couple weeks here. Again, most likely after Days Gone releases, but definitely stay tuned. So drop a like if you guys enjoy, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new, and let's get right into this. So late at night on Friday, Neil Druckmann tweeted the following. He said, that's a performance capture rap for Laura Bailey. Thanks for helping to bring one of my favorite characters to life. You crushed it. And he tagged his Instagram post. And if you check out his Instagram post, it's a picture of him and Laura Bailey. She has her motion capture dots all over her face because she's potentially recording motion capture for The Last of Us. And she is going to be one of the major characters here in The Last of Us 2. At the current time, she is an unnamed female character, but I'm sure we will be getting more information on her in the near future. Either way, though, she is well known within The Last of Us community. And so people are super excited and speculating about what role she plays in The Last of Us 2. Now this means a few things here. It's great that her motion capture work is done. That means her job is pretty much done. But what does that mean for The Last of Us 2 and what does that mean for future promotion and advertising and marketing for The Last of Us 2? Well, the fact that Neil Druckmann is posting on Twitter and on Instagram and announcing that the Naughty Dog team is officially wrapping Laura's motion capture work means they're probably coming up on the end of motion capture work for other characters as well. And motion capture is the last piece that goes into making a game. Of course, the programmers build the code and all that stuff. You have the level designers and motion capture is going on in tandem. But once the game is built, it, they're really just waiting on the motion capture work and the QA beta team, quality insurance beta team to test the bugs and glitches, etc. And that type of work leads up to the game getting certified for both Sony and Naughty Dog's team. And then after that, the game gets shipped out before release. A couple weeks before release, it gets shipped out. So we are nearing the end stages of The Last of Us 2 development. This game will not be finished development until at least a month and a half before it actually releases worldwide. So even though the game is probably like 95 or maybe even like 99% done, they're still not going to be officially finished and the game won't be considered quote unquote going gold until the last two or one months before release. But either way, Laura Bailey's motion capture work has wrapped up and should we expect a Last of Us 2 reveal after Days Gone releases? Because Days Gone releases Friday, April 26th. In less than two weeks, Days Gone releases for PlayStation 4. The reason we haven't heard much news for The Last of Us 2 is because that game is in the way. It's another zombie game, even though The Last of Us infected aren't zombies. They are infected. It's a similar type of genre, attracts the same type of audience and it's the same niche and they're both PlayStation 4 exclusives and Sony obviously doesn't want to be competing against itself with both games they want to make sure Days Gone has a successful launch and then that will open up the runway and the tarmac for The Last of Us 2 once Days Gone releases it's going to be full force with The Last of Us 2 guys Sony and Naughty Dog are both going to be going super super hard as well a few weeks ago Neil Druckmann basically addressed fans he said that he's heard the community he wants to share more when both himself and and the rest of the Naughty Dog team are ready. And honestly, I really think that's just an ode to the fact that Days Gone hasn't released yet. They're ready to announce some things, but they're not officially ready until Days Gone is out of the way. Sony has some type of pressure over them. They can't start doing their own stuff and really pushing The Last of Us 2 until they abide by Sony's rules of getting Days Gone out first, and then Naughty Dog can start pushing The Last of Us 2 with Sony after that. So I hope you guys enjoy. I want to keep this a little bit on the shorter side, just straight to the point news and information we can expect a big reveal very soon and this picture also confirms further progress for the last of us 2 we are very close to the end of the last of us 2 development and that is super super exciting there's been some changes to the youtube algorithm so that's why this video is on the shorter side i just wanted to test this out a lot of youtubers views have been slashed by like 50 or 60 percent recently the youtube algorithm changes all the time usually like once a year sometimes even more than once a year so i'm just going to test this out a super straight to the point video i hope you guys enjoy thank you guys so much for watching drop a like if you did in fact enjoy this video and found the information helpful subscribe to the channel if you guys are new and i'll catch you guys in the next last of us 2 video adios amigos